71 degrees outside right now right now it's november 7th november 7th unbelievable and it's 9 43 in the morning unbelievable Welcome back to Great Day at 9A. All right, whether it's a date night or a big party, coming up with a place to go can be a little bit of a hassle. Marcy Jones may have a solution. She's in Manchester this morning to show us. Hey, Marcy. Hi, Marcy. What are you doing? Hey, we're throwing some hatchets. We are here at Stumpy's Hatchet House. So much fun in Manchester. I'm hanging out with the owner. Nick, good morning. Good morning. So we were just chatting off camera that, you know, it's not just hurling a hatchet at the wall. You can make some really fun games out of it to kind of switch it up each time. So yeah. let's go through some of those versions. Yeah, um, one of my favorites is we call Tic Tac Throw. Okay. We actually put a Tic Tac Toe board on the, the target. So and then you basically play Tic Tac Toe. You can even steal the X or the circle by hitting it. Nice. Um, Always a good move on a first date to yeah. steal things. Yeah, yeah. that's Love a good it. one. Um, we also have this, this giant uh, uh, Jenga. Jenga set, yep. yep, and you can incorporate this into throwing. You okay, go, so how would we do that? What would the game be? So when you throw at the target, yep. if you lost that round, you'd have to come over here and then pull the brick, and then whoever knocks the Ooh, tower down loses. I bet that gets pretty noisy. It does. I it love fun. it. Now, speaking of noise, you guys have kind of a cool setup here. It's different than a lot of hatchet houses and axe throwing places yeah. because you have a little bit more privacy, let's say. I mean, yeah. it does look very open and cool, but... yeah. So, you're, you're not going to get put with a rando, right. essentially. Right, so when you book, you get your own pit, and we don't put anyone else nice. with you. Nice. And all the pits are situated in a way that they're they're away from the other ones. Okay. Um, so we actually have 12 total pits here. Okay. Um, we're kind of seeing six of them right now. But yeah, but this, all... this place keeps going on and on. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So there's a lot of space um, where you can have your own, your own setup. Um, and based on how many people you have, you get a certain amount of CDR. I love it. Now, we covered this, obviously, in the first one. Our first segment, we're going to say it again. Safety is a top priority. I think a lot of people, if they aren't familiar with the sport, yeah. um, they're like, oh, my gosh, of course I'm not going to go throw a hatchet. This is really fun and cool and safe yes. when you follow the rules, and yep. you guys definitely do your part in right. making sure people know what they're doing. Right. Yep, we monitor everybody. We're not, you know, treating you like like children right um we we let you do your own thing but we are making sure that everybody is is throwing safely here and knows what they're doing i yeah. love it all right so you suggest 13 and up right during yep. the weekdays and then when it transitions over to kind of to adult time what happens then uh friday nights saturday nights 18 plus only awesome all right so let's kind of head over so that people can see the pits if they missed our first segment and we've been saying this all morning, but this is such a great place to throw a party, a gathering. Mm -hmm. You can have your coworkers, your friends, yep. um, a girls' night out, a guys' night out, anything mm -hmm. like that. It's yep. really so much fun to get the whole crew together, right? Yep. Exactly, exactly. What um, is one of the most creative uh, parties you've seen thrown here? So we actually are hosting a really creative party. Okay. Um, it's we're calling it uh, Throw and Glow. Love that. So if you've ever done bowling and they have the black lights going yeah. and all that stuff, it's same vibe. Oh, nice. So, so like the, the lights the, are down. Yep. Black lights. The targets will be glowing. glowing the axe is glowing. No the way. The floors, the walls. We got some laser right. light shows going. Make sure you guys whiten your teeth before because people won't be able to see. Yeah. Okay. Should we try and throw a couple more? Yeah. Let's do now, it. Now, I have two witnesses here that can say, how many bullseyes did I get when we were off camera? I think you've gotten three. Thank you, Nick. Yes, I will pay you after this for saying that. Okay, so I'm going to put the mic down. We're going to try this. You brought out one of the bigger um, hatchets because the small one was just like too easy for me. You want to throw the big one? Should I? Yeah, do it. Nick, what? This is crazy. Okay, you can hold that. You can give, give why don't you give like a little um, play by play? Of what play by play? Yeah. Okay. All right, she's going to, she's going to step up. Oh, oh no. Do we, are you going to do it again? <laughs> do another one? Okay. All right, remember your form. Remember your form. Oh, no, the pressure. I think the pressure is getting to her. Oh, boy. Third time's the charm, right? Third time. Come on, Marcy. You can do it. You can do it, Mars. There it is. Yeah! But we did stick it, okay? Is that what it's called? It's cool when you no. stick it? Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's a very gymnastics oh. term. Thank you so much. <laughs> We've had so much fun this morning. Yeah. And if you want more information on Stumpies, what's the best way to do that? Uh, Stumpiesmanchester.com.
Awesome. Thank you so much, Nick. I've had a fabulous morning. Nobody got injured, of course, because safety is <laughs> number one priority here. You can have a lot of fun. Come on down, guys. Marcy, if you look in the back of the building, they'll find a hole where they put all the old axes in there. That's called burying the hatchet. <laughs> oh, I love it. And where no did you get that? No here this morning. Just really cool people bearing the hatchet. Absolutely love it. I got that joke from Caitlin. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you Thanks, so much. Marcy. I love it. <laughs>